Alright, hello everybody, welcome to another series that I'm doing on my channel. Uh, I'm going to be recording uh, Sea of Flame. It's a CTM map made by Vex, one of the earliest uh, CTM maps. And I am looking forward to it. I'm also going to be streaming it, so I'm live streaming it uh, at the minute, assuming everything's working. Um, but yeah, I've realised now that I need to really pay attention to my commentary. It's not just a you know, me playing, it's, you know, me recording and streaming, so it's, you know, vaguely important. But yeah, let's get going. This is uh, the Yuldi respawn point. So I'm guessing that's when before spawn points were changed. Um, and yeah, hopefully some people come and watch at least. But if they don't, it doesn't matter, because I'll be uploading it anyway. Uh, right, so these are the rules. I know them well enough. Uh... That's fine. Uh, this is an open world style map. As you explore, you'll find areas and dungeons. Good luck. Your first goal should be to secure renewable wood and also find the victory monument. I know where that is. This is my third time playing, I think. So yeah, I, I know. I don't know as well as Infernal Sky, but I know it well enough. Uh, it may be convenient to set up your base at the victory monument. Oh yeah, and also, bit of history, but this is actually... Uh, it was pure survival with no goal or anything. It's not really tailored for the CTM style of things, but that's okay. Monument's down there, but we'll go to get that in a minute. I'm hoping this is going to be similar to Infernal Sky. It's just something I can do uh, in my free time just to uh, get it done, basically. I actually do have a series of this on my channel, but it was done a while ago. And I was actually looking at past videos to see if I could see what version I was using and I actually figured that a lot of the videos still have no views on them so well, when I say still they're all still well they're unlisted I unlisted them a while back um, we need to go back down and get some more hopefully it doesn't turn night soon there's no clouds I wonder if I've got clouds turned off or something anyway I'm gonna be doing this for a while hopefully some people come but if not, as I said, this is just purely me recording uh, the map. I will upload this to YouTube, hopefully, at some point. I've, I've enabled a setting in my streaming software that records it as well, so... Unfortunately, I figured it records it in the same quality as the... Um, oh, that was dangerous. Yeah, it records it in the same quality as the live stream, so if there's, like, a quality drop in the live stream, you notice it in the... Uh, the recording, but I mean, who cares, honestly? I'm, I'm just doing it for fun. That's why I kind of had to go for a higher bitrate, was to get that quality. Um, but we'll see. I wouldn't be using music either uh, for the stream. Oh, that's not good. What even is that? That's a skelly spawner, isn't it? I don't remember that. Alright, let's... Might as well get a pick going. Try and get rid of that spawner ASAP. Uh, there we go. I mean, I'm guessing not too many of them can spawn purely because it's like so crowded there with blocks and stuff. Um, you know what? Let's actually get. Oh, there's a sapling. We need that. Renewable source of wood is vital in these. Did I. Oh, please tell me that didn't fall in the abyss. I think it did. Let's get some stone for a stone pickaxe and then we'll get more stone for other stone tools and that'll be fine. I did start recording fairly early. I streamed yesterday. Uh, sorry, I, I stream start streaming fairly early. People will still be in school. My viewers are mainly PvP based, that's what I meant to say. Um, so yeah, you, you don't expect many people to hang around for this. We need to get all of these logs. Uh, let's do that. And I think we're good. There might be another a chest on top. He sometimes leaves a chest on top. Might as well go and have a look. Because why not? Yep, there's a the chest. It's got one sapling in it, I guess, just in case we don't get any. Let's pick up that chest. It's been ages since I've played 1. some point. Well, uh, yeah, actually, no, it is. I'm I'm still recording this on an alternate machine because my main PC's hard drive is still it's still I've sent it away and it's still away at the minute. 
There's got to be another sa uh, another piece of wood up there. There's a piece of wood down there. Oh, an apple. Let's get that apple. Now, yeah, see, there's a skilly spawner underneath that I didn't deal with. Um, not because I knew that it wasn't on peaceful, but because I thought I would deal with it later once we got wood. Oh, hello. This could turn embarrassing. Let's go down. And we're in. Alright, easy enough. Yep. Shout out to Zombie Cleo. I had a friend once who I, um the guy that introduced me to Minecraft, I mentioned him. He he he, did, he recorded a series with Zombie Cleo back in the day, back when Minecraft was relatively young. Yeah, there's gotta be more more um what do you call it? There's got to be more say logs up there, but I'm just gonna leave them. Leave them be. Oh, does he see me? He does. There we go. There's a blaze spawner over there. I'm not entirely convinced I want to be going to get that chest so soon. But, I mean, we might as well risk it. I don't see anything. that We can get to the Victory Monument that way. We might as well. We might as well go. Let's go in. So, plan is to set up a base and then get find, uh, or go and find the wool as quickly as possible. Again, I'm not like a hundred percent sure where the uh, yeah it's down there. I'm not a hundred percent sure where it all is, but I, I vaguely remember where certain things are. We've got five saplings. Yeah, I think that's fine. We've got some string as well. Good start. Good start. Right, let's head down here. I'm not sure if there's any mobs, um, but we can figure it out. Greetings, Kazmic. Thank you for tuning in. Hope you're well, though. Got some good stuff here. I vaguely remember what's what, like the layout of the map, but I don't remember exactly. What the heck is that bed? It was glitched. Yeah, broken version. But there you go. <laughs> um, I think I should probably plant some trees as well. Although I'm not convinced I've got any dirt to do so. The Victory Monument is just around the corner. We've got potions, we'll take that. And we'll take all the armor we can get. So it is daytime, we've got gold tools, which... I mean, <laughs> they're better than nothing. Forget that stuff. We're just gonna go and try and take out the blaze. Uh, but yeah, I, I only had like one day of being a fresher. Potions. Might as well take out the blaze spawner. For levels. As I said, I think I started it slightly early um, because school will be still on in America. Alright, let's... Oh, wait. I thought there was another entrance. Or there was an entrance that was actually good. That just seems to go to a coal mine. Ah, here we go. I'm pretty sure this is a trap, actually. Although we're not coming in at the trap section. Alright, let's destroy that. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. There's the trap. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Okay. I feel there's more to it, but hopefully I don't tri uh, trigger it. Right, that's good. Got this, uh, the bow, the sword, arrows, more torches, and food. There's not much food, because obviously this was made at a time when you didn't need to uh, eat to, you know, get your, your hunger back. Because there was no hunger, it was just heal... Uh, yeah, it was just for healing. I'm not... Uh, yeah, I'll be honest, I'm not really sure who, who watches that stuff. I do it more just because I enjoy it. Um, I don't... Occasionally... Oh, there's some dirt. We need that dirt. Occasionally I'll, you know, I'll make a video and then think, you know what, I could... You know, maybe a lot of people watch it, so I can I can probably make a, do a good job on this and make, uh, it'll, it'll get popular, for want of a better expression. You know what I mean? I try to tailor it for a larger audience, but with CTM I just like, you know, I'm just playing, mucking about, and I just throw it up, which for a professional YouTuber, oh, I'm not a professional YouTuber first and foremost, but that sort of a mindset is not good for a, a professional YouTuber, but that's that's okay. Um, I'm not sure if there's any wool in this part of the map, actually. I've forgotten where most of the wool is. I, I, I remember the different locations, but I just don't remember if, oh, hello. I don't remember the exact placings of the wool. There's lots of coal which I guess we should probably 
take advantage of. That's the downside, I guess, of streaming, is that there'll be a lot of the grindy stuff shown. Like, for example, mining coal, which I won't do just yet. Although I will need to make another um, pickaxe soon, because my one is just about deed. Uh, but yeah, no, I understand there's a lot of grindy work goes into this that I usually edit out, but that's not possible on stream. I wonder what that is. I'm tempted. Okay, yeah, that's just the way out. Just the exit. Though I thought there was another room down here. This way. Yeah, yeah, okay, I, I saw this before. Um, there's a chest over here. Food would be appreciated. And there's food. Uh, let's see. I think there's something around here. Spawners or something like that. Certainly loads of lava. I can also understand like why some people don't like it, as in... It's... It, it doesn't give you the same sort of thrill as, like, PvP does, for example. Like, PvP gives you a very... Um... Adrenaline-based thrill, whereas CTM is definitely more of a, just a... You know, you, you play a, a, any old video game. I'm not saying Minecraft isn't any old video game, but it is, is somewhat special. But, you know, think of a video game you play and you complete it and it's, it's great and all, but it's not the same sort of adrenaline thrill that you get after, like, getting a PvP kill or winning a UHC or whatever. Um, so I can understand why some people don't like it for that. Also, some people, I guess, don't like it for the whole grindy aspect. You do have to grind a lot. Let's get some more trees real quick and then I'll head off. I feel like I missed some, uh, what do you call it? I missed some stuff, some chests. I missed some of that on the surface. I don't remember when I even uploaded the waking up, but my friend and I, we were pretty good friends, but it, there was points in that map where we were basically at each other's throats. It was like the most, you know, you know those TV shows you go on, or you don't go on, obviously. I've not been on any TV shows. Um, but there's those TV shows that you really see strained relationships because of the sheer intensity of what's going on. What the heck is this? Well, that was basically what that was, the, the, the map. Uh oh um, The map just tested their friendship to the max. Okay, nothing good up here. But yeah, I'm never doing Waking Up ever again. It was... Was it fun? It was alright, but there was points where it just became frustrating. Firstly, I'm running out of food. I'm not very good at conserving it. I'm not even sure what um, it was like in 1.7 regarding like saturation and that, because I know saturation was broken. 1.9, 1.10. I think there was a saturation glitch. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I, I seem to remember the reason starter food was implemented in the Reddit community was because of a saturation glitch in 1.7. Because certainly by the time I started playing UHC, they were, st they were doing starter food, and I think that was because of the the saturation glitch. I'm, I'm not sure if that was an SMP thing or a... Not an SMP thing, but you know, a, a server thing or a, a client-side thing. But maybe that's something that might play a part here. Oh, I, I, I can't remember where the easiest will is. That's the problem. I don't think the easiest will is down here. And if it is, yeah, the easiest will is definitely not down here. Uh, is there any blocks? There is some blocks. We'll take the stairs. Most of the new ones, I think, are fine in, like, 1.7, but... For example, Infernal Sky really couldn't be done in 1.7, because a lot of the map br is broken in the latter versions. Am I definitely on hard? I am. I'm not even sure if there's many spawners in this, to be honest. Anything here that's good? Uh... I thought there'd be more mobs. The reason I'm playing in 1.7 is because the... Well, I kind of figured there'd, uh, there wouldn't be the mob spawning glitch that is linked with uh, render distance. But there doesn't seem to be that many mobs. I knew about that. But where's the wool? Oh, there is spawners. There is spawners down here. Right, right. I remember, I remember. Is there any mobs though? There's no mobs. So that's the winning thing. There's no no mobs whatsoever. This is worrying. Okay, there's mobs now. <laughs> Maybe I'll die instantly and there'll be a case of oh, I don't want there to be mobs anymore. Okay, there we go. Let's kill these guys. I don't know where I don't know where everything else is. There's a guy behind me now. 
There might be, um, there might actually be some spawners in here. Just double checking. Don't know why I wasn't paying attention to that guy. I'm gonna have to put some regen on because I don't have any food. That's not good. No, there's that. Oh, they've all, they're all spawning now. They're all spawning now. Fantastic. Should probably light it up a bit. Go away. This is where my commentary goes to uh, pot because I'm just so focused. I was recording another game the other day. Oh, hello. Thank goodness. Thank goodness there was nothing in that chest that looked remotely worth picking up. And so it begins. <laughs> oh my gosh. I got rid of the spawner, I think. So there shouldn't be anything in here. And it's kind of lit up. Oh no! Okay then. Right. I do have a weapon. Let's grab all this. And let's get out. I think I got everything. I don't have any food on me. I've got zombie flesh and that's it. Uh, that, that. Might as well. Oh no! That's alright, that's alright. Uh, Strength that. Let's eat this so we can get our sprint back. From no mobs to every. Yeah. It just it was just so crazy so quickly. I think this is actually the worst wall to go for at the start. I've got a vague memory of it. Is that strength? That is strength. We should have used that. Let's use that. That should be a one hit to all mobs. We've got health. Don't have any food. But I mean... YOLO. Who needs food? We'll get some zombie flesh out of these guys. Oh, potions. More potions. Flippin' heck. He came out of nowhere. Did we get all our stuff though? That's the question. Oh, there's the wood down there. Get rid of that. I think we survived. There we go. I want this wood back. Right, we got it. There's still a spawner in here, but who cares? Let's just block all that up. Right. Let's go. Hopefully the frames don't die too much. Right, here we go. Yeah, this is the worst one to go for. There's so many spiders. Oh, this is going to be fun. And there's skellies as well. Oh, they're up ahead as well. Flippin' heck. I'm not sure eating food's actually a good thing, because it's just the zombie trash that's rubbish for, like, being nutritious. Having, you know, being nutritious, that's it. Um, there we go. Those guys up there as well. Let's just shoot them, because why not? Right. This is kind of cheating, but I'm just going to dig up. I think I've earned the right to dig up after getting through that without too many issues. Uh, and there's no food. Of course there's no food. Flippin' heck. I, I'm not sure how I approached this before. I know I died a lot in previous takes. Or not takes, in previous attempts. Magenta's, what, the third will? So we come, yeah, that makes sense. Dungeon 3 and all that. Okay, we'll just go with, go for that. Alright, so we've got the first one. Is there any more in here? There's zombie flesh I'll pick up. Wouldn't say no to that. Oh, hello. Now, I feel like we should go into the next part of the map. The only problem is, I know for, for a fact, Dungeon 4... I'll take that. Dungeon 4 is actually a lot harder than Dungeon 2. Uh, we might as well take it all. I've never, I never knew this was here. Okay, it's in all of them. We'll just take a few stacks. All right. Oh heck! Not gonna lie, that was somewhat fortunate. Now I'm not gonna do the whole kill myself to get hunger. I don't recall doing that too much in previous times, but I know I've done it definitely in the past. You know, now would be the prime opportunity. Just throw stuff in a chest, jump into lava. Sorted, full health, full hunger, on to the next section, but I'm going to try and play this as... I'm not saying that's wrong, but you know what I mean, I'm just going to... It's all about, I guess, how challenging you want to make it.